Uh, welcome back everyone let's implement scroll reveal animation in react using framer motion so we will use framer motion library which is used for animation in react js okay for the scroll animation so look at this is just an example i showed you how you can this is the rotate rotate okay and look at this is just scale uh, translate and rotate so different methods that you can use i will show you just two or three of them so you can also move to the documentation of framework motion so you can just see uh, different examples so i will show you how you can do it okay so let's start uh, to um, implement this so let's check it okay this is just three div elements the three sections that we have without animation uh, so first of all we need to install the framer motion okay so to install framer motion So just come here okay to the framer motion and install it using npm install npm install framer motion so after installing this now let's start to use it how we can use the framer motion in our application for that let's first of all import it okay so let's import motion from motion from uh framer motion so after importing motion from framer motion now let's use it so you can apply the motion okay the uh, animation and every this element if you want to animate this h2 div p you can animate all these tags okay using this motion so what you need to do just uh, prefix this motion before the element name for example we want to animate these div elements so we will just write this motion before the name of element like this okay motion dot div like this okay also for this one so let's write prefix that div and also for the third one that's very simple so after writing this now we will add this the properties of this motion so let's add the properties to this element so the first property is the initial okay so initially we will just write so for the initial the opacity for the initial um, whenever we initialize it okay the opacity is zero and uh, what else we need to add the scale the first one for the first div element i would like to apply scale so the scale is zero and while so uh, as you know this this is a scroll uh, animation and scroll so for the scrolling we will just add this property while in view okay while in view so here we will add the opacity to one back and scale to one back okay scale to one so this we have applied on the first one so let's look at for example let's come here so look at but let's add the duration also so to add the duration for that add it will add transition duration duration would be like two second let's check it now so look at that is two seconds so we have applied that successfully this was the first one that we have applied now let's move to the second one and the second one i would like to uh, uh okay from left side okay it should come from the left side to the right side so for that i will use translate x first of all i will copy all these three properties and paste them here and here instead of skill i will use translate x like this okay so here here we can specify the properties so the first property is for example we want to come it from right side so for that i will specify 100 pixel 100 percent so let's wrap it through uh, quotation 100 percent to zero percent let's now check it so it will come from right side look at from right side. if you want to come from left side so for that simply specify minus before 100 it means from minus 100 percent so let's go back so look at you apply that also let's rotate this one the third section for that again we would like to use let's copy this there are you can use all the css properties okay here even you can use margin parting whatever you want uh, change the color and just come here instead of this i will use let's use rotate rotate for example uh, we can use rotate x like 90 degree rotate x okay just come here and here we will apply rotate x zero degree let's now pick it just come here 
look at it looks like this you can change to rotate y just rotate or whatever uh, um, property you apply and you can change uh, i will apply margin padding change the color so you can do all this and this is a very simple example for that to apply uh, so um, as you know that this is just uh, applying the uh, motion and all the element is just okay um difficult to apply it and all the elements in our application you might be uh, developing um large a big application so for that you need to write a separate component for this motion and implement all these properties then just pa pass these as a children to that component to apply that and that okay so that's how you can implement the unscroll animation in um, react.js with the help of framer motion so if you like this video please comment down and like the video subscribe our youtube channel thanks for watching